to the vlog. Today is Monday, May 8th. Just got back last night from El Paso, Texas, which I probably posted in a whole other vlog. And my life is a mess. So today is a reset day after being gone for two weeks. Like, the struggle is real. There's clothes everywhere, I have to unpack. We just got back from the grocery store, went to the gym this morning. We did a lot, a lot of stuff and I look crazy. I also need to shower, but yes, tomorrow is Mark's birthday, so we're gonna be celebrating that. Mark's in the kitchen right now. He feels like making enchiladas, so we're just doing all that. And yeah, it's just chaotic and I'm leaving again on Friday to go back to El Paso for a quick gig, but it was such a fun time and I'm so happy that I went and it was fantastic, it was a great trip. I had to shower because I felt so disgusting after our flight yesterday, like we were so delayed and it's so humid here in Nashville today. It's been raining all night, all day. So anyways, I wanted to show you guys all the packages that I got. Wanted to do some unboxing. I pretty much already unboxed everything, but I thought I'd just show you like what was sent to me. Starting off with the Mixologist from Dry Bar. So this is like one handle, three attachments, and it has like the curling iron and then the crimper and then the, what is that called? The thingy. <laughs> but I'm so excited because I've been really wanting to get a new crimper and like try out my hair. So it comes with these three, attachments which is pretty cool okay what is this called if you know it comment down below and then it just has one connector so that's helpful because i'm like well maybe i'll take this to my trip to greece because i'm literally going to take only one appliance like and maybe i'll just take like these two to like be able to switch it up next up i got some purses from yenesi fashion um i think they're like Yen at yenesi i'll put it on the screen this purse is so cute. I've been really kind of in a slump with bags and I just got a new one in El Paso from this boutique, but this one is so cute. It's kind of like a light yellow green tintishy. It's very perfect for summer, spring. And then I got this one, which is like kind of like that Bottega dupe. This has been, this style I feel like has been around for like at least the past year, but it's so cute. And then it has the chain, but just a nice little handheld moment. I'm like, for sure coming with me to Greece. And then this one was fun too. I just love like the texture, uh, like the fluffiness or the smoothness. I don't know how to explain that, but I love this little vibe. It's like, I don't know, fluffy in a way, if that makes sense. Do you hear my voice? My voice is so tired. I also got some products from Shea Moisturizer and this is the anti-dandruff shampoo, which I'm a dandruff girly. I've been dealing with dandruff for since I was little. And I actually just put this in my hair, the anti-dandruff leave-in. So we'll see how that works. But dandruff is so annoying. Like it's kind of calmed down through the years, but it used to be really bad. Like when I was like in high school and like when I was younger. And now I feel like it's not as bad because especially because I'm blonde. So like you can't see it as much, but dandruff is not the vibe. No one wants you dandruff. I also got sent these um, antioxidant toothpaste from Kiko. It's like a clean toothpaste and it's supposed to be like non-toxic and not have like all the toxic things that toothpaste and tooth oral care has, which is so unfortunate because I'm like, we've been using these things for years and we don't even know that we're like literally making ourselves toxic, which is not cool. Also came with a whitening pen, which your girl needs. I'll take anything to whiten the teeth. So I'm definitely gonna try this out. And then a cute little toothbrush. Let's open her up. Ooh, I love it. I feel like that's like a really nice, just a toothbrush that's not electric. This will be like a good travel toothbrush for sure. Or like an extra toothbrush to have because I have so many toothbrushes now. I also wanna show you guys what I got Mark for his birthday. By the time this vlog goes up, it'll already be past his birthday, but he's been really into drip coffee. He's like, in the kitchen right now cooking, so I'm like, he can't hear me. Um, but I got the, him this like little drip coffee set because he's been really into this. Even though we have so many coffee appliances, we love coffee in this house, but I just thought this would be really cute. So I got this from Amazon. Um, it was pretty affordable and I like that it's like a kit, you know what I mean? So you have just a little station for it. And then some of the ones I saw were too big, but knowing him, like this is like the perfect size. So I'm very excited to give him this. This is one of his several gifts. I don't know if you're like me, I have to give several gifts. Like I can't just give one thing. I don't know why I'm like this. I just feel like it's never enough. <clears throat> I'm coughing because 
Mark is making enchiladas and makes the house really spicy. And my voice already hurts and I'm like, oh my gosh, I'm dying. But yes, so my next plan of action now is to unpack all of my stuff because it's just out of control right now. It's so gloomy today. We're actually going to dinner at STK tonight, but I have to pack. I'm going to El Paso tomorrow again, which I just uploaded the El Paso vlog. So if you haven't watched it, it's a good one because I was there for like 10 days. So got a lot of good El Paso content, but I wanted to show you guys something that we got for the kitchen that I'm so in love with. And it's this handy dandy light right here. So it actually detaches, okay. Not me using it as a light. I'm sure you've seen on TikTok how everyone has like the lights underneath the cabinets, but with this one, like you can re like you have to charge it. So all you have to do is like set it up. I don't know, Mark, set it up honestly. Oh, and then it's magnet. It's a magnet. That is genius. And then it also has different settings. So like it has like a little touch thing. So you can see as a lighter setting, like a cooler. Super cool. And then very cool. Wow. And basically you just touch it and it'll change like the light vibe that you're, whatever vibe you're going for. I personally like a good, let's see, I like this one. I like it, it's like a nice mix. And we also have it under, so once you like the light setting and once you charge it, um, we actually have like a connection right there so you can just like, if we need to charge it, we can just tr connect it right there. But once you charge it, it has different options, so it has obviously the on, like if you just want it always on, then it has off, of course, and then it has auto. And what I've been really liking about the auto, <laughs> oh my gosh, clip it back. What I really like about the auto is that when I walk into the kitchen, it just automatically turns on, obviously, it's auto. And last night I actually got up like at like three in the morning to, get some water and some electrolytes that I've been getting from Waterboy because I drank a little bit last night. I didn't drink a lot, but I was feeling dehydrated. And so I was like, I just like walked in the kitchen and it turned on and I was like, this is the best thing I've ever purchased. It also just looks really cool. Like it just like elevates. So I'm thinking we might get like two other ones because right now it's just like this middle one. Get one under here, get one under here, maybe. We have a very small kitchen, so it's not like we need a lot of it, but I was like, I really, I really like this contraption. That's all I'm gonna say. And um, I'll link it in my Amazon storefront or I'll link it down below so you guys can check it out. But I just like that you don't have to put batteries, you don't have to charge it often, and then it just like magnetizes. So there's my two cents for getting an Amazon light underneath, it's divine. You're more like, even on Christmas you're like, I got presents. <laughs> I have things to give you. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so you have several gifts, but some of them didn't come in time. Okay. This is dope. This is a big bag for this. I thing. know. <laughs> Can probably throw that in there. <laughs> Thanks, babe. You're welcome. Okay. Sorry for this terribly wrapped. Yeah, I was gonna say like. Like I know. I didn't have a chance to go find a bag. I should can you take a picture of this? <laughs> it's like that material. What the hell? <gasps> oh, it's on like Donkey Kong. So, my boy Adam Knowles. Shout out Adam Knowles. Was tour manager um, for the for the Old Dominion tour. Well, our tour manager for the Old Dominion tour, and uh, he got me into pour over coffee. There's, there's nothing like it. It's totally different. It's it's better. It's cleaner. I love it. So I got into it for a while, and now I have my own. And I like it because it's like, it's so like chemistry set-ish. Yeah. And it's just like, hey, 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 I'm about to make you the most incredible cup of coffee. <laughs> Ready, 
to go celebrate Marquito's birthday today. He is, how old are you, babe? 39. 39. Yeah. 39. I feel like 28. What would you tell yourself at 29? What would, oh, like what would I have told myself? Yeah. Like if I can go tell myself at 29? Yeah. Work harder. Were you not working hard at 29? I thought I was. But I think I could have gone harder. No, I know I could have. Yeah. Yeah. That's good advice. Yeah. Stop drinking. Oh. Or slow. Cut you back. still tell yourself that or? Yeah. <laughs> You're like, I've been slow. telling myself that for 10 years. Motherfucker won't listen. <laughs> 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 I'm all I'm all confident that we walk into a dive bar that I'm like de -de 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 -de. De -de tequila <laughs> So we're gonna go watch Guardians of the Galaxy three volume three. I'm gonna say volume three. three. Volume three. You gotta say volume three. Volume three. We watched the second one last night. We watched the first one the night before, so we could like so we're up to speed, you know. we could be up to speed. You know, we could be with the times. Um, and it's also like Mark's one of your favorite movies. It's my favorite of the Marvel movies. It, of your of the Marvel movies, really? Yeah, like out of all of them, like all the Guardians of the Galaxy is my favorite. They're pretty funny. I like I, them because they have like action and humor. I like them because they have music and music, and the music like is great. Good music. Yeah, the music very good. So, we're gonna do that, then we're gonna go to Eastside Bowl and we're gonna go bowling. That should be fun. Okay, we wanna just play pool. I don't think they have pool there, babe. They do. They do? Yeah. So you don't wanna bowl? Well, they have bowling too, well, we can bowl too. So maybe we'll just do like one bowling round and then we can like go play pool. Yeah, yeah. Okay. I ate so fast I couldn't even show you the food because I was so hungry after the movie. <laughs> Tacos. Tacos. I got a, uh, what did I get? A taco salad. I got like a taco salad. It was delicious. Where, where are we? In Fuego? In East Smash? It's cute. Suckers? It's so fun. Rollerblading is a blast. Demonstrating on what not to do. <laughs> okay, I'm writing it down. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you got it. You got it. Taking notes, taking notes. Alright, ready, babe? There you go. That's what I'm talking about. I didn't pray to Celine Dion. <laughs> Babe, can you bring it back? Don't bring it back so far. Ooh, it's my jam. All right, then nail the strike. Just don't think. How the... Hola, baby. 
verga, look at that, the fucking couch on this car. That is so Mexican. <laughs> <laughs> We're heading to STK for a little date night. My boo. I got ready today. Look at you, babe. Probably even Work. shower today. And cologne. I know you smell, you smell that. Yes, I yeah. Smell I love it when you work alone, babe. It smells like date night. However you want it. <laughs> You're like, let's go to Waffle House instead. <laughs> Oh my god, I love it! I'm like, I'm like a truck! <laughs> this is like my song. <laughs> yes, I love it! Did you see she won like all the ACM awards last night? This guy. Ooh. Girl, Ooh. go, yeah. Uh huh. Go. Mm. Oh, Florida. Florida. No one. <laughs> I made Anyone it. Anyone who's not Texas. I know, right? We're like, um. Oh. Or Nashville. Yeah, true. <laughs> no, no, no. Nashville drivers suck. They're terrible. <laughs> terrible. Um, I checked into the hotel, um, and I just took a shower. I got my hair done. I didn't even film me at the salon because I was just like, just so much happening. Traveling is such a thing, you know what I mean? But I have. It's 5.50, so I have an, about an hour before I start to sing. And yeah, so I'm just gonna do my makeup. Thankfully my hair is done. I don't even know what I packed. I honestly packed so last minute last night that I'm just hoping I pack something that I like. <laughs> don't even know, we're just going with it at this point. But it's totally fine, I am trying not to get overwhelmed, but it's... There's just so much always happening. So, but I'm glad I'm staying at the hotel tonight because it just makes things a little bit easier. Um, just makes everything go by faster. Okay, makeup and hair are done. Put on some lashes. Let me show you all the fit. Can you even see? Okay. Alrighty. This is the outfit. I'm feeling a little girly tonight and I'm wearing these shoes that I freaking am so obsessed with. And yeah, and this blue top, like I've never worn this combo. Yes, yeah, so this is the fit. And she's ready. And she's ready to go. Okay. <laughs> Okay, got ready in time, and I have 30 minutes to spare. Who am I? This is the view from my room. The Plaza Hotel, Franklin Mountain over there, downtown. Hey, yo, yeah. Okay. Yeah. With which ones? Because we're so long now, and I'm like, wow, in our blue top. Like Wish we didn't even like freaking anything. plan. Like, never plan our outfits and we're always watching my And I was gonna wear a white skirt and then I didn't. I think you probably have. I have white skirt. I think I have that exact skirt. Like, yeah. Yeah. But that's like very bougie. Yeah. Like, 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 yeah. All morning like I went to bed at like midnight which wasn't too bad but man I was tired like I slept so deep I literally was like I can't 
leave this position right now. Like I'm staying in bed and it's been really nice. There's something about being in a hotel room by yourself. It's like a vibe, you know what I mean? Like you just relax because there's like nothing else you can do really. Like I don't have to be anywhere until this afternoon for the wedding that I'm singing at, but it's the hotel vibe. I don't know what it is, but I'll take it. I will take it. Look at my view. I can see the Plaza Hotel from my window. <laughs> I was totally exhausted and I was like, I'm not moving. I'm just gonna relax. And actually one of my friends who used to live here in El Paso, she now lives in Minneapolis. She's a news reporter. She's in El Paso and she's staying here at the hotel. So I think we're gonna go to the pool and hang out for a little bit. So that should be nice. I should probably get up and like do my skincare and put on my bathing suit. Let's get it. All right, we're heading to the pool. I have a little hack. I have like my peak matcha packets that they sent to me and I love peak matcha, but I just love that it's in a travel size. I went downstairs and I got a cup of almond milk and then a cup of ice because I was like, I know that the, I know that the matcha here has a lot of sugar and I just don't want sugar. So I'm gonna mix my little packet. Oh, I just made a mess. <gasps> I'm making such a mess. Oh my God. Okay, hold on. Mixing. It's doing its thing. Just keep mixing. That's what we're gonna keep doing. That's all you need. And then we're gonna add the ice. Oh. You guys, don't ever let me do this again. I don't know who let me, who allowed me to do this. Alrighty, so we did a little pool hang. Was just hanging out for like an hour with the girlies. My girlfriend Mills, um, she used to live here in El Paso and now she lives in Minneapolis. She's a reporter, did I already say this? I don't even know. Anyways, I just picked up my sound system. Danielle got me a coffee from 210 of course and we stopped by Verde to get some lunch because I was like, I should probably eat at some point in this day. Um, it is 1.08, I have to be at the venue by 4.30. So we're, I'm gonna go back to Danielle's. I'm not staying at the hotel tonight. Um, I just wanted last night, which was like perfect. Man, I can't get over how tired I am. <laughs> I feel like I'm gonna get back to Nashville and like sleep for 12 hours probably. But I'm gonna go back to her house, eat, get ready, and then honestly just like head to the wedding ceremony, do that whole bit. Tomorrow's Mother's Day, so I'm gonna grab breakfast with my mom in the morning and my brother because his birthday is on Monday. I'm the worst, I don't even have a gift. I'm just running around, but I'll figure it out. I was like, I will figure something out. Oh. I don't even know what I'll figure out. Okay, this is the dress. It started it's so windy today. It's crazy, but the night is beautiful, so it's good.
birthday. Happy Mother's Day. Say hello. Hola. <laughs> Celebrating Mother's Day and birthdays. <laughs> 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 